Hello Internet, welcome back or welcome to my channel. My name is Tori and today I have an update for the Paranormal Panativity Project Pan. This project is a fantastic ladies collab that was created by Andrea. She will be listed in the description box down below as well as everyone else participating in this project. Let's jump into it. My first item rolling out comes for the comes from the Prompt Kelpie. So a product that you use in the shower or bath. I pulled in the Bath and Body Works uh, Vanilla Bean Noel Body Scrub. I kept it in the shower because that it leaks water because it's in the shower all the time. Since the last update, I did use it three times and that was finished on the 10th of April. Very happy that I used it <laughs> and that it rolled out of this project. And another item is also rolling out. And that is for the prompt, did buy? No, Dybbuk, there you go, the Dybbuk. The prompt for the Dybbuk is an item that is still in its box. So at the time, the item that was in its box was this Beauty Treat uh, Floral Fantasy Palette. It needed one use since the last update and I used it on the 11th of April. Um, I definitely have not used every single shade in this palette. That is something I'm gonna have to do in my rotation but I am very happy to that I've gotten some use out of it because this is a perfect palette for me to use right now during this season. So content with that. So before I talk about the items rolling in, I'm gonna talk about all the items remaining. I thought I just heard a dog powder. I'm going insane. For the Prompt White Lady, it's an item that is white or in white packaging and I have the Wet n Wild Malty Stick. Since the last update, I did use it three times. Obviously, with three uses, this is not going to be done. I don't know. I need to maybe use it as a base for a highlighter and have a little bit more shine in a couple days of the week. I need to find a purpose for it besides eyeshadow primer because I'm not vibing with it as eyeshadow primer. Next, for Vanishing Hitchhiker, a product that disappears quickly. A Jordana Black Eyeliner. It has not been used since the last update, so it is thriving. Next for Screaming Skulls, a Halloween themed product. I have the Wet n Wild Highlighter and Not Your Basic Witch. Since the last update, it needed 11 uses to hit its goal of 12, and it hasn't been used. So I'm sorry, Skulls. I'm very sorry, Skulls. Actually, I'm sorry for the rest of these items. Uh, next item is Banshee, a product you're close to finishing. I have the Becca Highlighter in Opal. I have not used it. I've been thriving with the purple highlighters. I don't know why. Purple is what I want at the moment. This, I realized why I didn't use it. This is for the Prompt Boogeyman, a product you use at night. This is the Laneige Sleeping Mask. I took it off my desk, therefore out of sight, out of mind. I will put this back on my desk. Um, because I really would like this done ASAP since I lost the lid. So, the items getting pulled in. Two items I am very happy and excited about. So, the first item getting rolled in is, <laughs> the prompt is called Demon, a product you were tempted, you were tempted into buying. So, um, it's <laughs> literally brand new pretty much as I'm filming this this collection just came out a couple days ago um this is the ColourPop and Alice in Wonderland collection if you didn't know I have an obsession with Alice in Wonderland so when I saw this dropped I was like I have to buy pretty much everything and I kind of did buy pretty much everything so this blush is called Silence bright red Mm-hmm. It's very bright. So my goal is going to be to use it five times. I'm very excited to try it and use it, but I will have to, you know, be gentle with it. Um, so I don't look like a clown. I'm gonna give it a little swatch because I have not swatched it, but it's definitely workable. I'm excited, very excited. And then for the next Pridem, next Pridem, bro, what? The next prompt rolling in is for ectoplasm and the prompt is a face mask. So this is the Creme Shop Jelly Mask. This is an intense overnight moisturizer from the Creme Shop with Chromie on it. Um, it's in the scent Raspberry and Truly. It smells amazing. I have been using it. My goal will be to use it 10 times. 
So I think that goal might be really simple because my skin has been really dry. Um, so yeah, a little chromey. Look how cute it is. And it's like light pink. Oh my god. Anyway, well, technically light purple, but yeah, that is my current progress in this project. Hopefully for the next update, I can get three to four items rolled out so I can keep on progressing at a fast pace. Um, but I do need to step my game up. Mm -hmm. I need to really badly. So hopefully I can do that by the next update. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoy me or enjoy Project Pan videos, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and all that jazz. Peace out, Girl Scout.